Chip War, the fight for the world's most critical technology, is a profound exploration of the global struggle for control over microchip technology. The book provides a comprehensive analysis of the semiconductor industry, its history, and its geopolitical implications. From this wealth of information, several key lessons emerge. Firstly, the book underscores the critical role of microchips in the modern world. These tiny pieces of semiconducting material are the foundation of virtually everything in our digital age, from smartphones and computers to cars and military equipment. As Miller puts it, military, economic and geopolitical power are built on a foundation of computer chips. This realization forces us to reconsider our understanding of valuable resources in the 21st century, shifting the focus from traditional commodities like oil to the realm of technology. Secondly, Miller's book highlights the geopolitical implications of the chip war. The United States, once the undisputed leader in chip design and manufacturing, is losing its edge to competitors in Taiwan, Korea, Europe, and particularly China. The book underscores Taiwan's pivotal role as the world's leading chip producer, making it a potential flashpoint in the escalating tensions between the US and China. This geopolitical dimension of the chip war is a stark reminder of how technological supremacy can influence global power dynamics. Thirdly, the book offers a historical perspective on the evolution of the chip industry. It traces the journey of the semiconductor from its inception to its current status as a critical resource. This historical context is crucial for understanding the current state of the chip war and the factors that have contributed to it. Lastly, Chip War serves as a wake-up call for policymakers, business leaders, and the general public. It emphasizes the need for strategic planning and investment in critical industries to safeguard national security and economic prosperity. The book argues that the U.S. needs to take serious steps towards an industrial policy that encourages domestic chip makers to manufacture key devices within the country. This is not just to safeguard against potential threats from China, but also to retain the U.S.'s current edge in high tech. In conclusion, Chip War, the fight for the world's most critical technology, offers invaluable insights into the world of microchip technology and its far-reaching implications. It serves as a reminder of the importance of maintaining a lead in technological innovation, the dangers of complacency, and the need to understand and engage with the realities of the global tech landscape. As the chip war continues to unfold, the lessons from this book will become increasingly relevant and urgent.